Hello, hello, once again, everyone. We are here just outside the cemetery. And we will step forth, breaking through the gates of the Forsaken. Two. The cemetery where we look for Chancellor's Altar beneath the cemetery. Okay, this is a teleport. Activate that. Oh, this guy. It's a. Cthonus the murderer. He looks very dangerous. We're gonna light him on freaking fire as our dogs do battle with the yellow demon. Um, these being the stronger enemies that we come against. It's kind of fun, more interesting to face than anybody else we've fought so far. Alright, let it burn, let it burn. Lots of skeletons here in the cemetery coming to eat us up. Um, we got a hide belt. I don't know if that's any better than what we currently have. Wow! Um, that's way better armor, whatever it is. It's worse gold to pick up, but I think the benefits are probably better. Um, regeneration. Yeah, I'd rather regeneration. Okay. The skeletons are killing my puppies. Don't hurt them. I need my dogs. What is this? Oh, that's the teleporting shrine. Da -da -da -da. I like how the ceilings just go away when you enter an area. Oh my, who's this? The Fortune Shrine. Ooh, there's an evil frog gargoyle. And this place, which houses nothing but up here, we have the Fortune Shrine. 25% find. Alright, let's go quickly explore up here just to see if there's anything. Oh, good. Oh, god. That scared me. That scared you guys a little bit. I jumped out of nowhere. Face off against all these guys here. And hopefully. We can get some items and gold from them. Whoop. Okay. When King Leo came to court, he brought many nobles with him. And nobles, oddly enough, want noble crypts. So I showed up with my shovel, thinking to make easy profit by digging a few holes. Ha! There's no stopping their demands around here. Now, I eat, sleep, and breathe dirt, it seems. Da -da -da -da. I kind of like those journals. Can we pick up a hood? Can we put that on our head? Yes! Wear this great hat. Oh, baby, baby. He put it on. Look at our hat. Look at our hat. It's a feathered hat. All right, let's go in this one first. Into the Defiled Crypt. Whoop! Frenzy Shrine. 25% attack speed. I like that. Apparently, we're going to face off against a lot of demons in here. Otherwise, why would they give it to us? So... Actually, let's bring forth a new posse of puppies. Oh my god, babies! Evil babies. Remind me of the guys from, from uh, Dead Space 2. Oh yeah, we can fire way faster now. Taking everybody out. That gets our job, and it is our job, stupid little imp. Get out of here. Alright. Massacre. 16 monsters killed in that little swipe. I like it. I like it, I like it. Let's explore these crypts of these rich people. These rich crypts, ooh, full of skeletons and insanity. Oh yeah, look at that, how fast we can fire. That's freaking crazy cool. I want this constantly. I wish we could level up our attack speed. Maybe there are some items or different things that later on we'll be able to. That is pretty freaking cool. Whoa. Skeletons battling my dogs over here. I kind of can't wait to like, get the frogs, too. Turn my dogs to frogs. And that would be cool. Amp. The dogs are strong, but not really strong. They don't really do as much as I would like them to do. Uh oh. They survive well, I guess. I'll give them that much. Let's go up here first. Ooh. Lots of skeletons. Blue skeletons. Are these ice skeletons? They're knockback skeletons. I don't know what that means. They knock us back. And I know what knock... Okay, yeah, definitely. I, just, I know what knockback means. I just don't meant them to us or who's getting knocked back. Whoa. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Lots of good stuff here. Pick up all this gold. We've got, um, I want the help. Adventuring, what do we get? Magic chest armor. Monster kills grant plus one experience. That's way better armor, so let's wear it. Let's wear it. I like how the little icon lights up when you have something that's better than what you're currently using. Kind of a cool little notification system for you in case you get lost in the shuffle of this constant neglect and you're not realizing what you're doing yet. Be gone, skeletons! I wish I could zoom in a little bit more to see my guy a little bit more up close what he's wearing and so especially since they allow you to alter their appearance so coolly. Did it fall down here? No. But I can go down the stairwell over here there. Hello candles. This is a very dark area. 
Not that cool though. I'm a fan. <gasps> What's this? A coffin. And a skeleton, of course, inside that coffin. Hello, anyone here? I like these dungeons. Uh, these imps are kind of crazy. Ah! They run away. We got to get away. We don't want to be killed by Ghost Robo. We know he's so strong. Uh oh. Uh oh. Everything's falling apart. It's like Indiana Jones ish. These ancient, ancient places and buildings. Any skeletons coming out of here? Yes! A ravenous dead crawls from the depths. Popping the ashes open. That's a dead end. But there is probably a beast. Oh, yes. Ravenous dead. We can take out in two little pops from our triple jam dart. You ever play triple jam at Chuck E. Cheese? The basketball game where the net, like the backboard, moves back and forth. Memories of our childhood. This guy probably had a cool childhood. The witch doctor, like, living and learning voodoo and magic and. Ooh, Tomb Guardian. This is a new guy. Hey, dude, what are you doing? Oh, he's calling skeletons. Oh, he's not that strong, though. He's taking him out. I just want to make sure we focus our fire on the dudes that are summoning guys so we don't have to deal with more and more. I do not have enough, I do not have enough mana. Thank you for letting me know, Sir Speedy. Anyways, what do you think this guy did for fun as a kid? Like experimented on frogs, or just practiced spells, or built dolls, or you know, watched documentaries about witches, or went to doctor conventions. Maybe he started out as a medical doctor and then just transformed into this psycho witch doctor with spells and creepy poisonous daggers and a hunchback and a big belly at a later date. Hello? There is a ravenous dead. What you doing, sir? Alright. No. Uh -oh. Very easy to take out. Oh, give me that gold. I want the gold! Don't really have to use the health potions as much as I might have thought. <gasps> a ghastly grave digger. That's cool. So there's more ghosts and skeletons in, in the, the crypt and tomb. In the outdoors, it's more zombies. Indoors, it's more. I mean, there's a couple of rabbits instead. But indoors, it's more what we were talking last time about you know, what enemies we find. It's more the skeleton breed of, of vicious creatures. Gold. You still have your imps, your crazy creepy imps. Which I think are kind of a fun enemy. They're just running around crazy little. Little goblins, little demons. Straight from straight from dead space to sprawl. What a great game. One of my favorite playthroughs I did, even though it was one of the earliest I did, one of my very first playthroughs I did, Stone Vault. Ooh, a well, hide belt. Not that we need it, but anyhow. Blue stone. Gold beneath the floor, that's everywhere. And bats. Bats and bats and more bats. Bats get out of here. Carry it, bats. Drop your gold and go home. Okay. It's kind of a very whiny tomb here. And now we're looking for the Chancellor's altar beneath the cemetery. I figured we'd clear out these areas for fun. Before, um, you know, we just didn't want to just beeline for the exit of the area. I wanted to get a chance to see the imps and see all the creatures that this place holds. Do, 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 do skeletons face my bats skeletons face my bats skeletons 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 where are we going it's a huge crypt like a weird like center and then it also has a nice axe to pick up our axe hey so it's got like a weird center and then all these like castleish wall pathways around the whole interior Sixteen monster massacre for us. Damn. That guy tried to escape the pain, tried to run away and be like, hey, I'm not dealing with fighting this guy. But we said, no, everyone here must die. Uh, Alright. Gathered my gold and knocked down the skeleton farmers. So many this time, holy cow. Pick up the 20 gold, pick up the 16 gold, and I don't even, man, we're like... The crown is not here. I will seek it in another crypt. Okay. Let's see. Looks like there's some middle area, but there's, like, it's not here, so I, I say let's teleport. Let's teleport. Wow, okay. Go check out the other one. Actually, looks like there's three. 
Well, let's go see this one. That's the one I want to see, and then we can check out the other one. Um, we'll fight our way to the end of- whoa. Who's this? Who emerges from the coffin? None other than Skeleton George. Leader of the 47th Boy Scout tribe. In this town 700 years ago. Let's go to the, the defile. Another crept. 